and for us it was the discussion about what's best for students and what's best for student learning and at the heart of all, of all of our decisions needs to be that question is what is going to improve our student learning outcomes what's what is best for our students and so when you consider a teacher mentorship program formalizing the the professional discussions that take place in an informal way in a natural setting in the school and say that the 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 thing that really interferes with those with those discussions and that professional learning is time, and so when you when you take the take the pressure of time away by saying there's a structured teacher mentoring project program, we are going to provide the time to, to actually be during the workday, not at the end of a long workday, but during the workday to have those professional discussions. Then together, a mentor and mentee are going to work together and ultimately improve instruction, which ultimately is best for our students. One of the things, a clear indicator of the importance of the teacher mentoring pro program in Revelstoke is the fact that we had 20 pairs of, of mentor-mentees apply for the program in the first week and a half when the call went out for the program. Uh, and we only have just over 60 teachers in the district. So not only do we have teachers that are fairly new uh, applying to be mentor mentees, along with mentors who are very experienced, we also have teachers in a situation that, that can see whether they're new or not, the value of the mentoring relationship. And we heard that this morning in some of the discussions where teachers are referring to their own skill set, knowing they're very, they're, they have a very strong skill set in one area, but not as strong as someone else in the other. And they can see where they're going to be shifting between a mentor and mentee relationship. So the, the mentoring program shouldn't be consi considered to be, um, I don't believe, in our context, limited to brand new teachers paired with very experienced teachers. It's a very fluid relationship that takes place and should be valued at all levels, whether you're a brand new beginning teacher or just a, te or a teacher who's now shifted into a different uh, grade level area, area of expertise, where there's always something to be gained from the mentoring. Mm -hmm.